what is up guys it is Ozzy Fishing Adventures and today we are gonna go down well first I'm gonna pick up my cousin it's gonna be a collab other than he isn't a youtuber sadly but I keep telling him he is he should be a youtuber but he's like no I got too much basketball he just made the Eastern team for you Eastern high so I'm happy for him but yeah go like subscribe we're gonna go to the Kanoi Creek first then we're gonna go to the yellow breaches at this big dam my dad said supposedly at this Kanoi Creek there's walleye I didn't think we should go to the Kanoi Creek but hey if we get into the fish that's all I care about. Go like, subscribe. I'll see you at the creek. Yo, guys, look at this. Do you see that, guys? Oh, my clipper is, um, uh, it should be in the, um, bottom thing. Um, but yeah, guys, look at that big dam over there. We're gonna fish here for a while. We might work our way up to the dam, but I highly doubt it. But I think, I don't know, we're probably gonna catch some fish here, I hope. Alright, let's get it, guys. We're gonna get it. Go like, subscribe. Time to fish! Doing some hardcore parkour. Oof, oof. Time for me to do some hardcore parkour, guys. Oof. Yeah. Oof. Guys, you ready? Oof. Oh my god. Damn. Guys, look at that. It's awesome. Yeah, guys. Yeah. They're CJ Cool 12. Go follow him on Instagram. Shut up. <laughs> He's an all-star on the Eastern School team. Basketball. You need to have a bio. <laughs> what? You don't need a bio on your fishing page. Uh. What do you mean a bio? Parkour! I said I don't need a biography about myself. Oh. CJ is 15 years old. No, okay. <laughs> You're not even 15. <laughs> Are you? Well, guys. I'll tell you when we get out of here and we're gonna head to the yellow breaches. Good boy! Yo, my boy just caught a chub. I saw that thing catch. Yo, holy crap. I thought that was a trout. <laughs> that is a big Yo, trouble. first fish of the day. Carson didn't get shut out. Now it's my turn not to get... What do you do? Not pinch his barb down? Nope. Oh, great. Oh, kidding. Come. Come out. Let Come out. Oh, there we go. Oh. Look at that, guys. It's just a chub. It's not that I know. Hello, Mr. Chubby. Oh my god, my name is Mr. Trouble. How are you doing that damn fish? <laughs> Excuse my cousin. Ready guys, the release. I love you, Mr. Fishy. You have not been caught by the Wizard of Oz, but the Wizard of Carso. <gasps> Goodbye. <laughs> right, we got a nice creek tub. Oh yeah. Look at this guy. You did not escape from the great Osney today. <laughs> okay, now you must leave. Now you must leave. There it goes, guys. Get it over here. I can't. Get him, get him, get him. He's stuck around the tree. I can't, Carson. He's stuck on the tree. We're going to have to get him, Carson. There we go. He's off, he's off. He can't even fit in the net. That's a rainbow. Here, take, I'm gonna take his time. Holy shit, guys, look at this trout. This is a monster. Nope, keep going. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. It's like a fucking sailor. Oh my god, Carson, I told you, oh god. Look out, look out, look out. I got him. Here. Oh god. Oh god, guys. This is a monster Here, trout. Let me get up. I'll get it. Up. Here. Can you get my can you get my rod? Oh God, he's about to fall out. There you go. That is the biggest trout I've ever caught in my life. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Carson, I told you there are monsters in here, didn't I? Oh my god. Guys. Oh crap, my camera turned off. Look at this trout. Let's measure him. Did you unhook him? Yep. Holy crap. Monster. <laughs> I feel right. bad for you, Carson, actually, now. <laughs> Beautiful trout. I'm just going to put him along here so you can actually see how big it is, guys. Oh my god. Alright, I don't think we need to measure this guy. We should get him back in the water. 
got it right there. I don't want them to die. Trout are very fragile. It's all right. I can measure. Where did it even come from? I don't know. It came out of nowhere. Um. He is 20 and almost a half inch. Uh, he's about nice and a half. Cool. All right, guys. Let's get the release. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I don't want to eat this guy. This is the biggest trout I've ever caught. Oh crap. Carson, you press my camera, it kind of turned off. Press it. There you go. Let's get this guy. Oh yeah, guys. As you realize, I said in the last episode, but I'll just say it now. I ain't catch, like, anything at the Yellow Breaches or Kanoi Creek. It was a useful spot. I go to my hot spot. And I caught all these frickin' fish. When me and Carson originally went down there, I I just didn't feel like recording. I just felt like having fun the day I went there. But there were like 25 suckers under this one tree, under the one tree. And I just casted it there, and, like for a little bit. And Carson was like, oh, all the fish scurried away. I'm like thinking, whoa, well, why in the hell did they scurry away? And then he's like, hit it, there's some giant on. So I hit it, and then on my rod, this totally bends. It was funny. <laughs> that was a great trout, guys. All right, go like, subscribe. Hope you enjoyed the video. And also, I forgot to mention, I'm going there tomorrow, the next day, to go catch some suckers. And also, since I already recorded this video, I actually caught the trout once again, the same exact trout. I thought it was a different one. I thought it was another giant trout. It was the same exact trout, and I knew because it had that little thing on its mouth. I don't know what that thing is, if it's a defect or if it's a result of somebody hooking that fish, but it has this little tiny piece of skin that's hanging, out of it, hanging on its mouth. It's really weird. It's like on its jaw. If you guys can comment below if you know what that is, that would be cool because I kind of feel bad for the fish. I mean, it looks kind of painful. <laughs> but, yeah, here's the video from yesterday what is up guys it is osney fishing adventures it is hunting season so i gotta watch out hopefully nothing bad happens it shouldn't but as i said in the last video well this is the same video i'm gonna be going back and try to get some of these big suckers i saw hopefully they're still laying along this tree and hopefully there's enough sunlight and the sun shining in the right spot so i actually see them because what i do is i sight fish for them and then they just suck it up and it makes it really easy to catch them. All right, I'll see you at the creek. Let's get it. Go like and subscribe to us in the fishing adventures. All right, guys. See if I can get anything. Casting up there on this reel, and I have a random, a regular worm on. Just reeling it in. Oh crap, there's a log there. I don't feel like getting stuck on that. Guys, we are back at the creek. Today, me and dad are gonna be fishing. He's fishing his fly rod because I just happened to told him there's some giant trout in here. And he saw my 20 like inch rainbow and he was like, oh my goodness. He, yeah, he's gonna try some of the flies he tied. I'm fishing worm as usual. It's still hunting season. I'm just adding this on to the last video because I absolutely caught nothing that yesterday. Let's get it. Go like, subscribe again, and hope you enjoy this. Hopefully we'll get something, guys. I have a feeling we're going to. Let's go. You go, guys, I got one on. Is that a trout? Yeah. Keep constant pressure on, don't horse it. Guys, holy crap. Got another one on. Brown, I saw it, it's a nice brown. Uh, oh, wow. You got your net, dude? Yep. That's a rainbow. Is it? I thought it was a brown. Oh. Holy crap, guys. You seeing this? Don't be ready yet. Get some tires first. All right. When you're ready, get your net further down into the water and then lead him up onto it. Oh, come on. Get in the net. Uh, he won't fit in. <laughs> he won't fit in the net. Well, you're going to have to figure it out, though. You're going to have to get him out of there somehow. 
There you go. Oh. <laughs> you now it's a rainbow. Look at that, guys. I think it's the same rainbow. <laughs> guys, I think this is the same rainbow. I just caught him again. Holy crap. Look at that, guys. What? Oh, yeah. Barely hooked, guys. Look at that. Whoa. Calm down. Look at that trout. Well, there's the same one I caught again, guys. Look, you see the lip thing? This guy's the same lip thing. All right, let's get this buddy back in the water. Whoa. He really wants to go, guys. Get my camera up a little bit. There he goes, guys. All right, well, that was fun catching him again. <laughs> now let's go get another one. I know there's more big trout than him in here. Guys, got one. Look at that. Big sucker. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, how my shoe's stuck. Crap. Ugh. <laughs> Here we go. Man, look at this guy. It's a nice one. Whew. Look at him. That is a good sucker, guys. I'm gonna measure it as a boy. Let me go get my measuring tape. Let's go. Osney is slaying the fish. Actually, no, I don't slay. I don't kill fish. Come here, buddy. Nope, crap, you got really dirty. Yeah. Nice doubt. Trying to find some still ground. Here's some still ground. Lay down. Nah. He's about 12 inches. He ain't too big, but he's still a foot long he's a nice fish let's get the release guys hello guys my name is mr sucker all right first of the day living it up gary's way no it's actually living it up osni's way there he goes he really wanted to go guys all right let's get another one guy got another one let's get it sucker That's small one. All right, this guy's a little bit smaller, guys, but he's still a nice one. Let's go. I'm telling you, Dad, these things would work great in the pond to eat all the allergy. Look at that, guys. Awesome fish. Look at the camera, but he's eating cheese. Look at this, guys. Look at their mouth. They're made to eat everything on the bottom. Awesome fish. There's the second one of the day, guys. Let's release this guy and get another one. Oh, let me just get down here safely. Do these guys like the cold water, Dad? Yeah. Oh, there he is. There he goes. <laughs> All right. He back down there. Let's get another. Guys, we're hooked up. Whoa. Oh goodness. <laughs> Jeez. All right, there we go. Third sucker of the day. Let's go, guys. It is fun as hell. Little small. Actually, no, yeah, that small. I didn't even see this one. He came out of nowhere. I was looking, I was trying to sight fish for a smaller one. And this bad boy came out of nowhere. Man, but what pretty fish these guys are. They're weird looking too, though. They're like alien fish. Whoa, come on. Chase it to the camera and say cheese, buddy. Come on. This is Ozzy Fishing Adventures. Ugh. Gotta get down here. Make sure I don't kill myself. Good, I didn't kill myself. All right. Let's release this bad boy. 
There it goes, guys. Back into the depths of the creek. <laughs> they're like they're like creek sharks. What the heck, guys? I was just fishing and I saw a koi. Like, if you guys don't know what koi are, they're these really fancy fish that are like not supposed to be in creeks. <laughs> there was an orange and black koi right where all the suckers were, just laying with the suckers because you know the koi and carp are like the same family and also suckers. But yeah, man, maybe sometime I'll pull a koi out of here and we'll send them to the pond at my house. That would be cool. That would be a good video. But yeah, I'm about to go back and watch some college football because it's game day, boy. All right, I'll see you next time on Ozzy Fishing Adventures. Go like and subscribe. See you next time. Good boy. Guys, you know what I just realized? That big sucker that I said was giant, it was not giant. <laughs> There are actually suckers in here. I haven't caught one yet. I hooked one when I was with Carson like the other day, but I ain't catch them, so it doesn't count. There is one. There's a few in there that are like maybe 19, 20 inches. Those suckers get big. Suckers get up get up to five pounds, and in this creek, they get up to five pounds. I've seen some monster suckers, and also I saw a big giant northern hog sucker. They don't come up here much, but they are big suckers, and they could actually get up to like. I think six to seven to eight pounds. The one I saw was probably about five. And it, they're, what they're different is like what they're they're different from the white sucker because they're like camo. They have these lines going down their back. It's really cool, guys. If you want to know like the difference, just go look them up. But they're really cool fish. I love suckers. I love trout. And I just love this creek.